If you're wondering what David Sinclair, a top anti-aging scientist, takes every day to stay younger and, according to him, healthy enough to live to 150, you've come to the right place. Welcome to House of Longevity. Now, let's get into it. The 54-year-old Harvard professor, who has a biological age of 44 and looks like he's 34, has been focused on epigenetic reprogramming, clearing away senescent cells, boosting NAD levels, and preventing the diseases related to aging. And his longevity supplement and drug stack shows it. Here's what he takes to stay young and healthy, based on recent interviews and social media posts. David starts his day with one gram of nicotinamide mononucleotide, or NMN, with water. As the biggest promoter of this NAD-boosting molecule, David has been taking it for years. NAD is found in every cell in the body and facilitates energy production. By the time you're 50, your NAD levels are about half of what they were at age 20. And so I know from measuring dozens of human beings that if you take NMN, for the time period that I do, I've been taking it for years, but if you take it for about two weeks, you'll double, on average, double your NAD levels in the blood. Next, David has one gram of resveratrol with a few spoons of yogurt or olive oil. The source of fat improves absorption. Dr. Sinclair led the charge in the early 2000s to promote resveratrol, a molecule found in small amounts in the skin of red grapes and thus red wine. Multiple studies have shown resveratrol promotes optimal mitochondrial function, supports a healthy inflammatory response, helps maintain healthy blood sugar levels, and activates sirtuins, which protect our DNA. He also takes a very small dose of spermidine, about one milligram. Spermidine is a polyamine known for activating autophagy, the process the body uses to get rid of damaged cells. Studies have shown that spermidine may delay aging in humans, help prevent age-related diseases, upregulate CERT1, support liver and brain health, and provide anti-inflammatory benefits. David rounds out his morning supplements with 500 milligrams each of physetin and quercetin, two flavonoids that help eliminate senescent cells. These are cells that no longer divide and don't die as they should, hence the nickname zombie cells, they are also CERT1 activators. At night, David takes 800 milligrams of metformin. Metformin is a prescription drug used by people with type 2 diabetes, which David does not have. Its longevity effects in various mammals have been shown in multiple studies, and some anecdotal studies have shown that diabetics who take metformin tend to live longer than non-diabetics who don't take it. It's believed to function by acting as a hermetic stressor on the mitochondria, forcing the mitochondria to repair and protect itself. Well, before I had access to metformin, I was taking berberine. It's, it's often known as the poor man's metformin. The thing with berberine, and we've studied it in my lab, it, it is effective at boosting energetics in the body, just like AMPK uh, and metformin does. Um, and we've actually given it to rats and, and mice and seen that they are very healthy, especially on a high fat diet. Um, so I, I think it's it's likely to be good. There are some human studies that exist, clinical trials showing that it increases insulin sensitivity. You have to take high doses. The other prescription drug David Sinclair takes is a statin. These are protective against cardiovascular disease by lowering LDL cholesterol and limiting the body's ability to produce its own cholesterol. David has been taking a statin since his late 20s as a preventative measure since heart disease runs in his family. David takes at least 2,000 IUs of vitamin D3 a day. D3 may lower the risk of several aging-related disorders. A deficiency of vitamin D has been linked to heart disease, type 2 diabetes, autoimmune disorders, and Alzheimer's disease. Among the many benefits of vitamin K2 are improved skin quality, stronger bones, better mitochondrial function, and improved vascular health. D3 and K2 work together to enable better absorption of calcium by the body. This prevents arteries from hardening, keeps your bones and heart healthy, and helps regulate blood clotting. Since NMN requires methyl molecules, David said that taking TMG will ensure that NMN won't reduce methylation in the body. And uh, so as a precaution, I take trimethylglycine so that uh, I continue to give my body a source of methyl groups. Now, I don't know if that's true. Uh, people ask me all the time. 
I take it as a precaution because I know that trimethylglycine is not going to hurt me. Glycine is good, as you mentioned, Joe. Um, and the other thing is trimethylglycine is also known as betaine, uh, which on human cells is very good for them, um, including protecting them against stress. So I don't, I don't see any downside. It's not an expensive molecule. And the upside is that I'm preventing my body from being drained of methyl groups. The exact dosage wasn't clear, though 500 milligrams to one gram a day is ideal when taking one gram of NMN. Finally, David takes 83 milligrams of aspirin a day. This can reduce inflammation and act as a blood thinner, which may reduce the risk of heart attacks. David Sinclair will be the first to tell you that research in this field is still in its infancy. So he continues to experiment on himself with different supplements and pharmaceuticals. He'll also tell you that he doesn't give health advice. He only shares what he's doing and his results. So will taking all these supplements make you live longer? Not on their own. The majority of factors that lead to a longer life are things like lifestyle and nutrition. The standard American diet will send you to an early grave, as will a sedentary life. But moderate exercise, a mostly plant-based diet with little or no alcohol, an adequate amount of sleep, and proven supplements like the ones Dr. Sinclair takes will definitely put you on the right path. And if you want to get some of the supplements David Sinclair takes in their purest form, check out DoNotAge.org, a health and longevity research and supplement company. By using my link in the description and coupon code STARK, you can get 10% off every purchase. You can also save more money by subscribing to the products, which will ensure you never run out. Thanks for watching. If you haven't done so already, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And check out one of these videos next.